Hello, my Piscians. Hello, my loves. Happy Thanksgiving to all who are celebrating. I hope it's a day full of laughter, happy tears, food, desserts, wine, alcohol, whatever it is. I hope you guys are having a great day. And to all who are um, alone or however you're spending this day, it's a one big hug from me to you. Thank I, cause I'm very, very thankful of you guys. It's a day of giving thanks. And I'm very thankful of you guys. I truly am of all of you. So I have Tarot of the Mystical Moments for the main deck, Wheel of Fortune for the clarifying deck, Four of Swords, and an Ace of Cups. Some of you, this is pretty much your energy, maybe. It's just kind of chilling at home. That's what that feels like, Ace of Cups. Your cup is full. Four of Swords is just at peace. It's just, it's just at peace. Ooh, Hangman Reverse and a Seven of Cups Reverse, which I usually say that is like the Ace of Cups. Uh, Four of Swords, there we have is the King of Wands Reverse and the Hermit. Might be trying to hide out from a King of Wands reverse. Um, let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. Maybe maybe work has been stressful. That's what that King of Wands reverse I got. Maybe you're taking a, um, a long week. Well, we are on uh, with a long weekend, but maybe work has just been really stressful and you're just taking a much needed um, break from work, vacation from work. All right, let's see what's going on. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a Pisces, know a Pisces, feel like being a Pisces. Look at this magician and Nine of Swords reverse. Getting your power, just filling your cup up. I love it. Okay, let's see where we're at. Let's see where we're at. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Collect the messages for the Pisceans. Collect the messages for the Pisceans. Collect the messages for the Pisceans. Collect the messages for the Pisceans here. All right, collect the messages. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Collect the messages for the Pisces. Knight of Cups, there you are. Page of Swords reverse. Ooh, and the Seven of Wands. I just, I really feel like this is you guarding your energy from anybody who would bring you shitty energy or bad because the page of swords reverse honestly could just be bad energy bad news it's the bad it's it's getting bad news and so seven of wands is you trumping that this is you just saying you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna beat you before it even happens i just feel like some of you are really just pulled back some of you you know honestly some of you may not have even made some of you could have made excuses not to even go to family members house and be like i just want to stay home I just want to watch Netflix, be with my fam, like with my love, my cats, whatever. Okay, what's influencing the Seven of Wands and Page of Swords reverse? What's influencing the Page of Swords reverse and the Seven of Wands? What's influencing it? What's it? Well, what's influencing it? There it is. The Seven of Swords. I, I get a, a strong protection mode. Magician and the Three of Swords reverse. I feel like this is where you are. And once again, the Nine of Swords reverse and the Magician. Some of you got something really good going on. And maybe an ex is just nosy or their family's nosy, your family's nosy, whatever it is. I feel like this is you very protective of whatever you have going on. Nine of Swords reverse. You just don't want to be bothered. Seven of Swords reverse because whoever you got rid of in the past, whoever these energies are, it is a snake underneath those flowers. You already know the game. You know the drill. You've already been down this road. You've trusted them in the past and you're the one who was on the other end of, holy shit, they took off with my, I mean, look at her. She's out for her own interest and there was Pisces interest down there. She didn't, she just didn't care. So what's influencing you guarding your, your energy? is the seven of swords is somebody trying to weasel their way back in and i just feel like you're you are ahead of the game on this one what's the reason for the reading what's the reason for the reading look at that five of ones and three of pentacles reverse pisces like i'm not having it yeah six of pentacles reverse you're not interested past energy need not apply pisces is not interested what is in the past by the way pisces like you don't even need to pull a card i'm just not interested I, I'm not really getting fully love here. I, it might be a family member or a friend or 
I feel like honestly, somebody took something from you monetarily because of, with that card in the Six of Pentacles reverse and, and the Magician. When you put these two cards next to each other with then a Two of Cups reverse and a Queen of Pentacles reverse at the bottom, that's not a great winning combination. It isn't. I feel like this is a major manipulator. A magician by itself is a fantastic card, but next to a seven of swords, I feel, feel like this is a fast talking used car salesman right there. And in the past, I think it was just, it just seemed almost too good to be true. And so in the, and two of cups reverse and a queen of pentacles reverse, it honestly almost feels like this was the story they weaved. So let's just say this was an, an energy. If this, some of you, this could be a lover. Some of you, this was like a friend. They, they were never understood or, or nobody under, you know, like, have you ever met those people? Like they were always the victims in their life and you gave them the benefit of the doubt. And now you quickly realized that this person is the villain of their own life. Okay, what is on your mind, Pisces? What is on Pisces' mind? Fool in the four of wands. It's seriously, Pisces wants to be just home. I think you're you're really good where you're at. Empress in the seven of pentacles reverse. Empress, you are really good. Who I'm reading for, maybe some of you are also pregnant too. And because look at this 401, some of you might even be fixing up your home. But the seven of pentacles reverse, what I'm getting with this, with the seven and the seven, you're not interested in giving this person anything. You're not interested in giving them energy, money, love, attention, especially attention. I think this person likes a lot of attention. Might honestly be a family member. And you are just like very numb to them, unaffected by them. They are annoy the shit out of you. Eight of Pentacles reverse. You see them clearly. Seven of Cups reverse. Um, Empress is, I feel like this is a, you're in your energy where you are, your life is good. And there was a time where I feel like you tried to have this person in your life. If this, let's just say this was a sibling or a cousin or a friend, someone, you tried to have them in your life. You tried to help them. And I feel like they, they took, I feel like they took from you. And this is a person who would come in and not only did they not pay you back, but they would still try to get something else from you. And you know it. Okay. What's the near future, Pisces? What's the near future? Very specific reading today. What's in the near future? What's in the near future? What's in the near future, Pisces? Oh, but they got game. They, they think they got game, Pisces. Five of Wands, Nine of Wands reverse and the Emperor reverse. But when you say, nope, not interested in whatever, uh, what is that snake oil you're trying to sell me? This person's going to throw one hell of a shit fit. I really think you guys are doing something good. King of wands and the 10 of pentacles and they know it and they just want in on it. Stay seven of wands is you at the center of the reading. You are really strong protecting your, you and yours. And I love that. I love that. What is that ace of cups again? Hangman reverse and this. Yeah, I think you see this person exactly and you're really protective. King of swords and the nine of pentacles. Very, very protective of this energy. Page of swords reverse, seven of wands influenced by the seven of swords. Page of swords reverse and the seven of wands influenced by the seven of swords. It just feels like, honestly, some of you, this is like a family member you might come across. Just watch your wallets, watch your wallets. Page of Swords reverse, Seven of Wands influenced by the Seven of Swords. Page of Swords reverse and the Seven of Wands and the Seven of Swords reverse Pisces. What is this? And the Death card. No more uh, Mr. or Ms. Nice Pisces going on. Death card. Actually, I feel like this might be the story they're coming in with the whole change process. I've changed. Why the death card? Why the death card here? 
Scorpio, why the death card? I feel like you've cut them out though. Six of Swords reverse. That tells me, I feel like that's the story they're coming in with. I've changed. I know I, I didn't pay you the back and I can't pay you back. But if only you give me this, I'll pay you this plus that. Six of Swords reverse says don't do it. Energetically, it's not going to go anywhere. Five of Wands is, it, they still feel like it's kind of doubling down. It's, yeah, with the Five of Wands, it's, it's uh, who, somebody... These energies sometimes, I don't even know where they come from. It's just such a manip manipulate. Every card of manipulation is out here. It's, it's wild. What is the Six of Pentacles reverse reason for the reading? What is the Six of Pentacles reverse reason for the reading, Pisces? What is it? And the Ten of Cups reverse. There you are. Reason for the reading, Ten of Cups reverse. It's... It's disappointment, unhappily ever after. You've given and you didn't get back. Six of Pentacles reverse. You didn't get what you were owed in the past. Why the Ten of Cups reverse and the Knight of Wands? And I feel like you've moved on from it with the Knight of Wands. But, and the Fool, I still feel like this person is also going to play you as a Fool. Because remember, the Fool, he doesn't, he, I don't know. It doesn't show you in this card, but usually the fool carries a tiny little bag, which shows that he doesn't carry the past with him. I feel like this person doesn't remember the past because it suits this person. He's not going to remember that he really owes you what he owes you. Very specific. I think this is going to be around money, six of cups. This person's going to play up the whole emotional aspect of your friendship or family. They're going to they're going to play it in could be a business adventure adventure or somehow somehow you are going to need to help this person um and it's going to have to do with some type of resources but they're not going to remember they're not going to remember what they already owed you or how they treated you remember the snake is coming back because it is a bigger snake they feel like they could still play you what is the magician in the past pisces what is the magician in the past Oh, Queen of Swords, but I unfortunately this is the it's it's unfortunate and fortunate at the same time. I feel like your sweet Knight of Cups self gave this person the benefit of the doubt, but after this person, after they disappointed you so badly, I think it turned you into a Queen of Swords with everybody, not just them, with everybody. I think you don't p trust people at face value anymore with your money, your time, your energy, your love. I think you're very you ask a lot of questions nowadays. You don't, you know, are you, you might even be a little bit jaded. You might be a little bit more like, yeah, I don't buy it. Your eyes are more open to the ways of the world. Okay, what is the 401, Seven of Pentacles reverse and the Empress on your mind? And this, I'm telling you, the Seven of Pentacles reverse is you're just not, some of you literally are going to give birth. Some of you have a business idea of your own. Some of you want to buy a house. There's things you want to do for you. You don't have the money to give to a snake to invest in their snaky dreams. On your mind, Seven of Pentacles, Reverse, Empress, and the Four of Wands. And the lovers. I like that. On the side note, I think if you're in a relationship, your relationship's looking really, really good. King of Wands, lovers, really good. I do feel like some of you are focused on buying a house and that is looking very good. Why the lovers and the uh, four of wands? Lovers and the four of wands, justice. New contracts, if you're trying to buy a house, that's looking very, very good, by the way. Wheel of Fortune. As I'm tapped into that energy, eight of swords reverse, I think that's gonna go in your favor if you're, tr if you're waiting on hearing on some type of legal paperwork. Five of wands, near future for Pisces. Five of Wands, near future, Leo energy. So has this person got game? Is Pisces falling into this person's game? Five of Wands, Six of Pentacles. Pisces, what are you going to give them? A middle finger or your some pennies? What is it? What is it? Six of Pentacles and the Five of Wands. Six of Pentacles and the Five of Wands. Up, oh, Six of Cups, reverse. Ooh, what is that about? 
Six of Cups reverse. Seven of Swords reverse. We have a Seven of Swords there and a Temperance. I feel like an ultimatum with that Six of Pentacles and a Six of Cups reverse. That might be an ultimatum, like give me what I want or I'm out of your life energy. Because remember, we do have a Page of Swords reverse here, and that is a very bratty energy when they don't get what they want. They're very, it's a very charming energy when they're trying to get what they want. And it's so ironic that the Empress and the Snake come out because I usually think of the Empress with the Snake because with the flowers. And I feel like this is the, this is the energy and mimics. And this energy comes after taking from an Empress energy. And I feel like this is a person that mimics other people. And I feel like this person's coming in mimicking something loyal, something good, something altruistic. Even though it's probably screwed over many people. And I feel like when they don't get their way, I just feel like, yeah, Six of Cups reverse, I don't, I, I don't honestly think you're going to give to them whatever the Six of Pentacles is. I feel like that's more of them almost demanding with the Five of Wands. I feel, yeah, at the Six of Cups reverse, I feel like, I, I honestly think that's the end of that relationship. And that's where your long-term peace and the Three of Wands reverse is. It really is feeling like a family dynamic of some sort, Pisces. This might play out over the weekend with the holidays, but unfortunately, it might be unfortunate or fortunate, depending, because this is a snake that might need to be de dealt with here. All right, good luck to whoever this is for. Um, have a great week. Have a great holiday. I love you guys. I'll see you guys soon. Take care.